In 1902, a pivotal moment arrived when the club underwent a significant transformation. The club was facing bankruptcy and was on the brink of collapse. It was during this critical moment that John Henry Davies, a local brewery owner, stepped in to rescue the struggling club. Davies not only injected much-needed funds into the club, but also provided stable financial backing to help the club get back on its feet. He became the principal investor and owner of the club, assuming the role of chairman. With his vision and support, Davies rebranded the club as Manchester United, symbolizing a new era and fresh identity for the team. The name change represented his ambition to represent the entire city of Manchester, and it marked the beginning of a remarkable transformation. In the post-war era of 1945, the footballing world witnessed a defining moment in the history of Manchester United. The introduction of a man whose name would become synonymous with the club's glory, Sir Matt Busby. Busby took the reins at Old Trafford in October 1945, charged with a mission to revive a club that had been heavily impacted by the war. The club faced significant challenges, with its stadium, Old Trafford, devastated by bombing during the war. But Busby's optimism and determination knew no bounds. From the start, Busby brought a fresh and visionary approach, focusing on youth development and attacking football. He believed in nurturing young talents and instilling the Manchester United way of playing. Under Busby's guidance, the club's fortunes began to rise. In 1948, they secured the FA Cup, laying the foundation for future triumphs. But it was the emergence of the Busby Babes in the 1950s that would capture the world's imagination. A squad of young talents, fearlessly taking on the best in the league and conquering hearts with their exuberant style of play. Success followed, with league titles in 1952 and 1956, and the club's reputation soared. Manchester United became known for their attacking flair and the spirit of the young players that adorned the famous red jersey. The Busby Babes showcased a thrilling brand of football that dazzled spectators and earned admiration across the footballing world. The camaraderie among the players was a key ingredient of their success. They played not just as teammates, but as a closely knit football family, with a shared determination to succeed. Tragedy struck on the 6th of February 1958. Manchester United, known as the Busby Babes for their youthful exuberance, was returning from a European Cup match in Belgrade. The aircraft, a British European Airways plane named Elizabethan, had to make a stop in Munich to refuel due to adverse weather conditions. Tragically, during the third takeoff attempt, the plane failed to gain altitude, crashing through the airport's fence and into a nearby house. The disaster claimed the lives of 23 people, including eight Manchester United players and three members of the club's staff. The footballing world mourned the loss of such promising talents. In the wake of the tragedy, heartfelt tributes poured in from all corners of the globe. Football clubs, fans, and communities united to honor those who lost their lives. Sir Matt Busby, the manager of Manchester United, was critically injured but miraculously survived. He showed remarkable resilience and determination to rebuild the team in honor of the fallen. 